I don't know at this point. I don't know what they want exactly, but I know that he's doing a report for what he saw. This is um, Dave Adams, who's our attorney. So, what what are the next steps for Chantel? Good evening, sir. This is Officer Zabo from the Espanol Police Department. Good evening. How are you doing? Good. So, well, you know, uh, could be better. I'm really sorry this happened. Um, yeah, no kidding. But uh, I was, as I as I was explaining to uh, your your friends here, um, it, this is not my arrest. I I did not make that arrest, and I cannot. Nobody can go against uh, another decision, uh, another officer's decision. Right. Uh, Does she have an old bond tonight? No, the, the state doesn't have bonds. They did away with that about three years ago. But she has to see a judge. And then, uh, based on they base on whether she's a flight risk, her history, and right. the severity of the crime, they determine if they most people get let out on on ORs nowadays, and then right. they they get like a a promise to appear type of situation. Um, if she doesn't have like a crazy history or she's not a flight risk, uh, the DAs would have to request a um, a dangerous or detention hearing which I doubt they're going to do in this incident right. just because yeah, it's not any history. right so most likely she'll see the judge in the next uh, 48 hours um, and then the judge will make a determination from there and then once she's released from jail she'll get set a court date so she'll basically get arraigned and most likely she'll get released and then uh, she'll be set for pre-trial after that how do we, how do we know? well I appreciate um, Guys She'll have to call you when this, she gets to probably going to turn into a civil rights issue with the school, you know, because the security guard should have done better in controlling the situation. Yeah, and I don't know, like I said, I, I don't know what happened either. This is Sergeant Zach Wright. I wasn't there. Mm -hmm. I just briefly spoke with the officer who's doing the paperwork who arrested Chantel, and he told me what he saw from his side. Um, yeah. And he and he said it was there was a lot of people. Uh, they was starting to get tense in there, so they were trying to clear out the gym because uh, Espanola was getting a little upset because they were losing, and there was right. water bottles being thrown and other things like that. So they were trying to clear out the gym and get the team off the court. So it was. Uh, so I don't know. I wasn't there, but. Is Mark still there? Mm -hmm. yeah, he's at. He's at the. He's doing the paperwork. Oh yeah. Yeah. Well, I, I do know that you guys are, are limited in what you can do, so I appreciate you at least talking to me and talking to the family and helping them calm them down. I know that nobody can do anything about Chantel's situation right now. But we'll no, yeah, she's got to see the judge, um, yeah. and she'll, she'll get arraigned probably tomorrow or the next day. Okay. And then whenever she gets released, she'll be allowed to make a phone call to a family member to come get her. So she's going to Rio Riva Detention Center so in Tierra Amarillo, okay. which is about... Whew, Four, three, three hours from Albuquerque, probably. Yeah. It's an it's an hour north of here, so. Can we can we have our request that you know we check on her well-being because you know we don't know. <laughs> well, she's at the in. hospital right now okay. with our detention Would officer. Would they let us see her? Not at the hospital, no. Well, then how no. are we supposed to check on her? Well, that's why the doctors are checking on her. Well, we want to know. We want to know. I can call you and let you know. Yeah. Because they'll give her a packet, well, that, they'll give her that. paperwork. I mean, we've never been in this situation yeah. before. We can understand that. Yeah. Well, yeah. So um, they give them paperwork once sure. once yeah. they determine they're they're okay to go to jail. Basically, mm -hmm. for somebody to not go to jail, they have to have like serious injuries yeah. or be pregnant or, or like serious injuries. Yeah. If they clear her for jail, they give her some paperwork, mm -hmm. and then that paperwork gets turned in to the jail with her other paperwork. Okay. Um, but no, you can't go to the hospital. She, she's an inmate at this. Point. So she doesn't have, 
Um, we're just a holding facility. We just arrest people here, do their paperwork, process them, and then we take yeah. them to the actual detention okay, center. Okay, so, so like from my standpoint, since I was assaulted, I want to file a police report, so how do I do that? Uh, what yeah, happened over there too, right? Yeah. It, was, it was all the same incident. It was all the same, yeah. That's how it started, because she got grabbed, you know, yeah. and that's what's being put. Uh, I can take your report, <laughs> okay. uh, I Well, the, so, uh, so Officer Webb said he could put her statement in his report. Uh, okay. He's no, already writing a report. Handling anything. He's I mean, actually that's dirty. a really good... That's really dirty. <laughs> yeah, he's already yeah. writing a report okay. anyway. We, we, even, we had to tell him, just so you know, to take his, his knee off of her neck. Yeah, okay. Because that was scary. Yeah. Oh, I, I can so, imagine. Um, he's actually a really fair officer. It's, yeah. it's pretty one well, of I the mean, best. I mean, even for like a female, I'm like, oh yeah. my god. Yeah. Oh, um, <laughs> well, would you be willing to write out a statement? Yeah. And sign yeah. it? Because yeah. if you do that, then. I think then it's, it's then yeah. it's coming exactly we your words. Off. It's yeah. your yeah. words. Yeah. And then Absolutely. and then, uh, and see and I could just have Officer Webb attach that to his report and then and it's not on the officer it's on this Christopher I understand. Lopez yeah. I understand that. yeah Christian yeah. Lopez who's the head of like I said the head of yeah. security yeah, he, he slash started everything <laughs> so. do you mind if I check officer, uh, so yeah. talk to Webb for a sec sure okay sure I'll, I'll, be, uh, I'll be right back It, it almost it almost sounds it almost sounds like there wasn't enough people to handle the you know like it's like you got a security a security officer yeah. and like one officer well, right and, and then, then again they're not fully trained to handle big crowds like that I mean who puts a police officer yeah. in a crowd you know you're you have weapons tasers so what if somebody took that away from him you know okay. But what escalated the whole problem was that security guard. Well, <laughs> you know? well I guess the water bottles that I, started the yeah. whole thing. Uh, yeah. I, that started the whole thing. Yeah. Then the water bottle led to one thing. Then yeah. one thing led, and then, yeah. but somebody throwing a water bottle on the court, I guess, is kind of what sparked the. the but like, like I said, I I wasn't there, yeah. and mm -hmm. and so I I don't know what happened, but yeah. Yeah. I just know that that Espanola lost, and they probably weren't taken too nice, kindly oh, to shit. it. Oh, they were paint, paintball and BB guns the oh, bus. The yeah, <laughs> that's gonna be filed. So I know, that. I know With that's NMA. crazy. Yeah, yeah. that shouldn't be right. I mean, that's not right <clears> to do that. Yeah. So, so let me, um, you know what? Okay. All right. Thank you so much. You guys see where that white car is? Yeah. I guess they're, they're you can either drive or walk over there. I'll take you. We'll go in the office where it's warm and there's light. Okay. And whoever saw it, if you didn't see it, I don't need a statement. But if you actually saw it, we'll write out a statement as to what happened, <coughs> at least from your from your point of view, what you saw. But some of them, the ones that left okay, already, like so my I other brother and his wife and my parents had to leave with the no, grandkids. Well, yeah, if we write what, a statement, we're practically going to be summons to court and all that. So okay. I was right in the middle of everything. Uh -huh. so. <laughs> I mean, we don't need 20 people to say they saw the exact same thing. We only oh, no. need like one or two people to oh, say okay. this is what I saw. Maybe he was right there. Yeah, we don't need yeah. we don't need oh, 20 oh, witnesses. Gee, I was better than security. Yeah. I was trying I know. to break up everything. Yeah. Dude, I was yeah. like, come on. Okay. Yeah, and we, so I seen like knee skits. Uh, I had well, and he he, he, well, he said, <laughs> and Officer Webb said he uh, he doesn't okay. think that Chantel knew he was a police officer. Yeah. Okay. And then I guess her okay. uncle, maybe you, came up and said, hey, put your hands behind your back. Repel yeah, Too so you'll hear my voice. So I know my arms like all sore now. I'm like I didn't yeah. feel it then. I think there was just all the adrenaline. Yeah. Yeah. Then again, I think I don't know. It looks like she sort of got knocked out. Like I said, I'm a first responder. She just tensed up. If that's not her, just to you know. Like hey, she's a girl. Yeah. I put people's hands behind her back, especially girls. You go after the pressure point. But I think she was so yeah, tensed yeah. up to where she was she couldn't do nothing because she was knocked out. <laughs> you know. Well, and I like I said, but. When but we we'll take everybody, we yeah. everybody we take to jail um, goes goes for a medical clearance, and hopefully she tells the doctor if she did hit her head yeah. that she tells the doctor I hit my head yeah. because if she does that then I'm they'll look into it. it. But if yeah. she doesn't tell the doctor that then you know they're not gonna obviously look at her head. But um, so who wants to fill out statements? Um, well, we, it was suggested like that um, we should fill it out. Whoever saw the incident happen, that way they're there. So. 
me. But put set, yeah. So you yeah. two oh, yeah. want to fill one up? No, they two set whoever, whoever saw the incident. Show. Do you guys want to go inside and fill them out? Yeah, okay. Where there's light and stuff? Okay. So just go on the other side of that white car and I'll let you guys in. Okay. Blank call, JV towing, total secure now. Simple.